Today I'm feeling amazing. I have so much to be grateful for. I love my van life. Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, last time you guys saw me, I was at the lake. Today, I'm at the beach. It's not much warmer here, but um, it's a little bit warmer. <laughs> it ain't 16 degrees outside. After being released from my most recent deployment in February, I have had the ability to move freely without any obligations. My van life affords me the opportunity to save money since my monthly expenses are typically lower. However, most importantly, I'm not tethered to one place by my material possessions. Today I am parked at the Oregon Inlet Campground in Outer Banks, North Carolina. The weather is cloudy and cold with severe thunderstorms in the forecast. Since it will rain for the majority of my time here, I will take this time to fix my hair and get some much needed self-reflection done. The reason I'm here is because I haven't found a place where you can camp on the beach um, boondocking style. So I just decided to get a get a um, campsite for this. I didn't really feel like driving around and dealing with park rangers because I'm actually in a state park. So um, yes, that is why I'm here. getting pretty crazy out here so apparently there's going to be a storm and there's a flood warning until 2 p.m. today and I'm trying to debate if I should go like further inland but like there's so many people here and none of them are budging I look so crazy why do I come on camera looking crazy I just wanted to share this moment with you guys. Oh 
all right guys it is day three at this beach and it's still very windy but it's sunny out so i am going to be attempting to finish my hair i've got my up in the pipe cleaners I have the pipe cleaners in still and then in a couple of days I don't know maybe even a day because usually I don't like to wear these very long because they do pull and they can dry my hair out so after a couple days I'll go ahead and take these out and wear my curls it's a vibe all right guys I'm back for an update on my current situation it is day four at this um, this beach. <clears throat> day four, night three. Today I have something. Yeah, I got one more night to camp here. That's the shower area. We need to go check it out. Wait. Okay. I'll be back. Close this up. Okay, so this appears to just be the bathroom. Go check out like a smaller building. Oh, hush your mouth, child. All the wind is getting in. Oh wow. Oh wow, and it's like oh yeah. Needless to say I won't be using that. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm at a community college, but they had this vacant lot I found and uh, it's empty. I am in, still in North Carolina. Like I said, just a few hours closer inland. And I had to kind of slow down because my tires are giving me concern. Hey baby. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah these tires are giving me a bit of concern there I don't know if you can tell from this side this child on the other side so something's going on to where the inside of my tires are going bald <clears throat> as you can see these were brand new I had some issues with the shocks I had it replaced, um, but there's a whole lot going on up front. When I first got the truck, I had to have sway bar fixed. 
and because when I would stop it would pull to one direction I had that fixed but I don't know it there's a whole dictionary of issues I'm sure underneath the truck since it was sitting up for two uh, 20 years almost 20 years it's 2002 so maybe 15 years is that up so yeah I went to a mechanic this morning and uh, they asked me to come back tomorrow morning there's a mall cop coming let's see, let's see if we gotta move Yay. Hey babies. Hey Rokan. Here they go. boys doing their thing let them get tired and then they're gonna take a nap boys So today is Thursday and I'm at the mechanic because like I said yesterday my tires are messed up and um, they're taking a look at them for me so whatever they got to do they better do it for under five hundred dollars <laughs> I have it but that's not in my budget we'll put it like that gotta speak the right things over your life we'll see what the mechanic says wish me luck So, I just left the mechanic. I'm not discouraged, but I'm definitely motivated. Motivated to do what I need to do. So they said my whole front end is shot, which makes sense. Everything under my truck is rusty and I've had to have almost everything replaced at this point. So the whole front end needs to go. So that includes Normally, I would jump, be like, yes, let's do it. I, let's go when I'm working. My goal is to continue living this lifestyle 
not being at work has been so freeing. It's like, give me, give me a couple weeks, y'all. <laughs> but right now, I'm just feeling a little overwhelmed, a little stressed. Not high stress. It's okay, honestly. Like, it's not that I don't have the money right now. I just have plans for that money right now, so that I can be able to venture out and continue living this life um, and be able to pay for these unexpected things that come up with the truck um, but yeah so I went ahead and got new tires just so I wouldn't be like bald going down the road and my plan is to just keep those rotated every oil change for now um, until I can get the ball joints and things addressed about to drive bro driving really calms my nerves so i'm putting about to put some music on about to put on some music and just go okay i think i figured out where i want to go i think i want to go to, so I'm going to go to Great Smoky Mountains National Park. I just wanted to come back and wrap this video you guys have come along with me to do quite a few things and it's a really good time to go ahead and wrap it up so thank you guys so much for watching the next time you see me I will be at the Great Smoky Mountains National Park so be sure you tune in to that video we're gonna be in the mountain So, until the next video guys, bye!